Rashmika Mandana is also known as the national crush of India. But did you know that she almost did not become an actor? If you want to know why, stick around to find out. Welcome to IMDb Spotlight, in which we tell you new and interesting facts about your favorite artists, all sourced from their IMDb credits. And today's Spotlight is Rashmika Mandana, who is known for her performances in Pushpa The Rise, Dear Comrade, Geeta Govindam and Sita Rama. According to the awards section of her IMDb page, after being named the National Crush of India by Google in 2019, Rashmika was also named the most influential Indian actor by Forbes in 2021, surpassing Samantha, Vijay Devar Konda and Yash. The metrics considered were the average likes, average comments, engagement rate, average video views and the follower count on the social media profiles of the celebrities, with Rashmika gaining a social media following of 22 million on Instagram early on in her career. Rashmika was initially offered the role of Vidya in the Hindi remake of Jersey. However, she had to let go of the part as she felt she would not be able to do justice to the film due to her prior commitments. She was also offered Lokesh Kanagraj's master, but her busy schedule didn't permit her to commit time to the film. Rashmika is nationally known for her debut opposite Rakshit Shetty in the Kannada romantic comedy Kirik Party. But did you know that she started modelling in 2012 when she was only 16 years old? While many might know that she won the title of Clean and Clear Times Fresh Face 2014, Rana Dagubati and Akshay Kumar were among the jurors, what you might not know is that she was ready to go back to her college life pursuing her degree in English Psychology and Journalism post the competition. According to her IMDb page, her plans changed when after her ad was printed in the newspaper, she received a call from a production house to audition for a role in their film. Initially, she thought it was a prank call and she blocked the number. The production house then reached out to multiple people around Rashmika, but she still ignored them. Finally, they reached out to her college teacher, who then told her to go and audition for the film. Being an obedient student, she auditioned for the role and was cast as Sanvi in Kirik Party. Since then, Rashmika has conquered the hearts of millions across various Indian languages, including Telugu, Tamil and Kannada. But did you know that she is vehemently against being dubbed in her films? She learns the language before her debut in every industry, including Telugu for Chalo and Tamil for Sultan. For her role in Pushpa the Rise, she hired a coach to learn the Chittur slang, which is a mix of Tamil and Telugu. She believes that after learning the Chittur slang, it's easy for her to perfect any Indian language. According to her IMDb page, she's currently fluent in six languages. Rashvika has also used her social media to raise awareness against various issues, one of them being water pollution. Her photo shoot near Bellandur Lake in Bengaluru to raise awareness about the issue went viral shortly after being uploaded on the internet. This photo shoot brought focus to the lake that had been severely polluted as sewage, chemical effluents and construction debris were being dumped into it. She couldn't step into the lake as it posed a health risk but the photos went a long way in highlighting the grave situation. Rashmika is known for her amiable and happy-go-lucky attitude, which is why the makers of Dear Comrade had initial apprehensions about whether she would be able to portray the intensity required for the role of Lily in the film. Later on, she was widely appreciated for her nuanced performance. According to her IMDb page, she used to take rigorous cricket training every morning for her role. She said in an interview that the second half of the film was so demanding that she used to cry every night after going back home due to the intense nature of the subject matter. Despite the film not being a commercial success, she considers it as a milestone in her career as it taught her the importance of speaking up and it showcased her abilities as an actor. Rashmika has acted in several commercially successful and critically acclaimed films, including Chalo, Pushpa the Rise, Geeta Govindam, and the recent and highest rated title on IMDb, Sita Rama. But did you know she had almost passed on her first role? As a student, when she entered the audition meeting, she wasn't even able to move in front of the camera and wasn't comfortable with somebody giving her cues from behind the camera. 
she was going to leave the audition and go back to studying when the makers asked her to just talk to them and recorded that. They were impressed by her expressions and cast her in the film on the spot. Looking for fun facts and trivia about movies? Visit imdb.com or download the IMDb app. And if you are a big Rashmika fan and think you know more such facts that the whole world would enjoy, don't forget to add them on Rashmika's IMDb page.